stream's over, guys. Sorry. Say bye to YouTube. You see the camera? Fuck you, play. Uh-oh. Wow. Because I just got in an accident. I'm doing it for today. Today! 32-38. Yes! Parkour! Hi guys, today it's Football Sunday. We're going to Sands to play a $250 poker tournament. I'm just gonna bet football on win all day. All right, be right back. All right. My dad wasn't sure if he wanted me to use the car because he got a new car, but he's a proud DJ and Papa. Come on, asshole, let me in. Thanks. Almonds. Two banana and a muscle milk. It's the, be it's the best we can make happen. <gasps> wow. The gamble gods are smiling upon us because I just pulled over to go to the 7 Eleven. I was prepared to pay the ATM fee, even though it's not the GTO move or it's GTO. And then here's my bank. Please tell me I can drive through. I refuse to enter the bank. We are about that suburban life. Ayos, meals. Hi. Oh my God, they got a drive through teller? Oh my god, I gotta drive through fucking Teller. What? The suburbs are crazy. I might have to live here one day. So we got our 800 and all 20 ready to go. We're getting close. So this is a $250 one day tournament. I think it's a bounty, which are dumb to late register for, but whatever. I'm getting the D-Gen tingles. I'm excited and let's fucking win. My budget is $1,000. I'm willing to re-enter once, but then I'm gonna play fan duels and bet on football games because it's NFL Sunday. So let's go. Nice. Yeah, when I see the sign, that I, I wish it were a cooler song, but I honestly hear like Ariel like going, uh -huh. Sands. Parkour! We gotta go, because we're late. Also, we must remember that I had a heated battle back and forth with fuck nuts here at Sands Casino with security filming, so I'm gonna be on the low as I navigate my way in, and then we'll get settled, and then we'll fucking disrespect their rules. So we're in. I know I said I'd wait till I get settled, but really, I can't wait. I'm two feet in, and I gotta film. No, 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 no. Lifetime for a moment. And I feel so epic. It's my moment. I'm gonna win today because that. Okay. It's change. There it is. There's a hundred dollar bounty chip. Yeah, and it's stupid to wait register for it, but let's win. <laughs> I just said that was got a. I thought someone had the eight with it. Check. Ace high. All right, we're in the first break. Starting stack is fifteen thousand. I have twenty-one thousand. Really funny hand. Hey guys, welcome to My Donk Hand with Ryan DePaulo. We're sitting in the tournament with 12,500 chips. There's me and there's the villain. We look down at Queen King offsuit with the Queen of Hearts and the King of Chef's Hat. We decide to make a raise and the big blind calls. Now we don't know what he has. The flop comes Ace of Diamonds, King of Spades, Four of Penises. He checks Dark, the villain. I bet 1500 He now raises to 6000 and we decide to jam for no fucking reason. He calls the only 3000 more, and we have Ace-8 against Queen-King. On a flop of Ace-King-4, we're only 20% to win the hand. And then a great comes, and we suck out. The end of being a fucking- Another, No other hands to report. I got 20k. Three entries are over. Oh, and also, I bet $150 on the Seahawks getting three points, and then the Broncos later, and then my dad, and I just booked it, put in a bet with me for 115 for the Bucks minus one and a half, and I'm just booking it though. Okay, it's 12 o'clock, I got the pregame show on, I played a bunch of fan duels, obviously I'm a Jets fan, there are no Jets in my fan duel lineups, that's only logic, I can't get let emotions get in the way. The game today, I have Tampa Bay against the San Francisco 49ers, that's game number one tomorrow night, is the Houston Texans against Tennessee Titans. I don't believe in Tennessee. There I go. Good luck to all my uh, D-Gens out there. I'll be back to you shortly. There are no Jets in my FanDuel picks. Get out of my fucking life, Jimmy Buffett. This dude is everywhere. On vacation, I see him. On Broadway, I see him. This is annoying. They're all trying to leech off Buffalo Gold success. They got Fugazi Buffalo. So again, for 1 o'clock, I have the Seahawks. Um, against the Panthers. I don't pay for picks. I almost did this time because Steve Stevens having such a T 
teaser promotion. Steve Stevens, AKA the bookie killer. I'm doing a promotion today that I rarely ever do. What I'm doing is five days of my personal plays for $200, 877-220-6540. They almost got me, man. Wish I could do that. I wish I had the balls to like sell picks. It probably looks something like this. Hello, sir. How are you doing today? I'm good. Good, good. You betting any games today? Yeah. Well, look, you sound like a really smart guy. Now, what would you say is a typical play for you? How much are you risking on a game? One to two hundred. Now, since you're not an absolute idiot, it follows that if I had an absolute stone cold lock, that you'd be willing to go as high as, say, five hundred? I guess. I guess so, yeah. So then it also follows that you're clearly not a man with spaghetti dog shit for brain. In the right set of circumstances, you may be willing to go as high as 1,000 if I had a pick. It only comes around once a month of Vladimir Putin level, Hadouken type of slam dunk, grand slam type of lock. Again, that only comes around once a month maybe, tops? I mean, I guess. Well, we got three of those games going today. For a one-time payment of only $399, recurring weekly, you could be part of our package. Now, how do you handle your business, sir? Visa, American Express, or MasterCard? Visa. Good. Welcome to the fucking dog shit pick club. All right. Now I'm in the food court trying to do the don't get diabetes challenge and eat something that won't make my toes get amputated. So let's see if we can find that. Wow. They got entire robot stores now. That's fucked up. We're all fucked, there's gonna be no jobs. But at least we'll have cool Beats by Dre headphones for only $99.99. I'm just getting a stupid turkey sandwich, but the tournaments are fast here. It seems like an easy field, but I like it because the hands are going fast. People are acting quick. It's nothing like the Borgata fucking tanking. It's also a little more of a rinky-dink tournament, but whatever, I don't mind. I'll, I'll trade that off uh, to see a lot of hands. It's, it's good. A few moments later. So, third hand back from break, I busted. I King, King Jack under the gun which is questionable to raise in the first place off suit, but the table is weak. Flop comes King Jack five, all diamonds. Turn is a five of clubs. She checks, I bet like a dummy. Then the dude jams, and I only have like 8,000 more. So I called, and he flopped, and he flopped the flush. I didn't hit on the river. We lost, down 250, gonna play stupid slot. Or video poker, video poker. A few moments later. And we're gonna play until they, they get us, because security here, don't play with us here, right? They're looking, so let's get to the video poker. But Mush is in Florida, actually, and he's filming footage of him, be him being at the dog track. Paul Harrison asks, where's the Mush? All right, now we got two to Royal. I'm not gonna make a mistake again. What, what am I doing, yo? Dude, I'm so dumb right now. All right, done, Sorry. we're focused. Oh, the stream's over, guys. Sorry, say bye to YouTube. Sorry. All right, it's over. Bye, guys. Us, we made it. I don't know how long was that. Am I going to be famous now? Six minutes. Well, a little bit. Ryan DePaulo, Degenerate Gambler on YouTube. Ryan the... DePaulo, De just Degenerate Gambler, you'll find me. Thank you. Sorry. So then I'm playing a little bit off camera, trying to front for the security cameras that I wasn't only there to film. I'm also a degenerate, so I'm, I'm, I'm happy to play hands, but I wasn't filming. And then... This happens. Yo, 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 oh my god. They made me stop filming a live play, but I just hit four fucking deuces. Yo, I'm so mad I didn't get this on camera. I hate you so much, Sans. I hate you so much. I hate you, but I love you, but fuck you. See the camera? Fuck you, because I didn't get this live. Dude, I was sitting here playing off camera. Wow. And then I hit four fucking deuces not on film, but it's a good day, it's a good day. Woo! Why am I mad? This is good. A few moments later. All right. So we're cashing out. I put back 50, but we're up 540 on the day. Is the bottom motherfucking line? Fuck you, Sands. Maybe I'm gonna play one more thing and then leave. I'll see how much they're on me, but let me go turn this to cash. There's a lot of workers. There's a lot of, a lot of workers. 950. Woo! There's so many workers. Like this guy was just lurking when I started filming. There's so many lurkers like him, like old, eld, older Asian people, not to be racist, like hovering around. I saw one of them by the food court. They went by the free sugar and the guy in the place was like, no, 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 as if they knew. And then she just walked away as if she understood what no, no meant. Like, I don't know, she's going to go steal free. I don't know. Here's another. It's like weird. Whatever. I'm going to do some parkour. Parkour! 
Fuck you, security. All right, let's go. Now we gotta go. I don't know why I'm so pissed at them. It's because, like, they're robbing you guys of, of all seeing that jackpot with spots like that. Those girls were really nice, but it just, it's, it sucks. One day, we'll fight enough for degen rights where we can film and be degenerate with each other in casinos. 12 seconds later. All right, I'm so much less mad now because one of the girls who I said were really nice just saw me as I'm walking out and was like, Yo, when you edit the video, make sure we look good in it. And I was like, yeah, you're already in one posted live play, but I got you. She's really cool. Um, so thank you for being nice. You guys were the nicest people to ever stop me from filming. I'm mad at Sands. It's, I'm mad at Mr. Sands. That's who my contentions are with. That's who I did that parkour at. It's not good to do parkour at people. You get injured that way. Today I had to do it, even though I'm up 540 leaving. I might not make it out of here without doing one more stupid stab. Two hours later. Oh God, the cops saw me gambling and driving. I'm fucked. No, I'm just kidding, look. This car with 339 miles got hit by some lovely old people. Fucking literally, this 85 year old guy on meds just drove into the side of my car when I was going straight. Completely straight, wasn't changing lanes, nothing. 100% oldness fault, but what are you gonna do besides fix it? Two hours later. All right, so I didn't set this up too well at the time, but basically, I get home from the car accident, I'm, I'm all bummed, and then I check my fan duels, I got $148 in lineups, and I'm doing fucking really well. But you need the games to end, because any, any play is bad for you, basically, when you're at the top. I was third out of like 1,500 people in a $33 contest. Any play is bad for you, it really only has potential to drop you, essentially. And so I needed anything but the Steelers scoring in any way. Um, basically, only a Broncos interception could hang me on to winning the amount that I, I may go on to win. No spoilers. Yes! 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 Fuck out of here, yo. Holy shit. Holy fucking shit. Dude, if John Connor or Adrian Peterson, I mean Adrian Brown, uh, Arian Brown, what the fuck is his name? If AB or John Connor, who everybody owned, scored, they were on the two. Or even if Ben ran it in, I would have lost fucking gone from 3,000 to nothing to 500. But I got the Broncos defense too, so. Hey guys, it's your man Ryan, aka the Fan Duel Killer here, and we just had another good Sunday. We put in 104. Oh fuck, I got the wrong screen up. This is embarrassing. Jesus Christ. We we oh fuck fuck. I'm butchering this bit. We just put in 148, and we taken out 32 38. Thought it might be 5K, but. But, but this is a great win, and if you want wins like this, you just gotta send me your credit card info, and, and it can happen for you. I'm just kidding. I don't, I'm not really a scam artist. <laughs> Hit me up! Woo! Now, maybe that button there, ad funds, is for most of you schlubs and slip laps out there, but for me, I need to withdraw funds, man. I don't gotta add no funds. I got funds. All right, so what was the update, Dad? What'd you win and lose yesterday? Only lose with my mouthful because I lost money in Fanduel. How I much? Two contests, fifteen dollars. What do you want me to say? How much did you win? Uh, should I start all over? No. Tampa Bay was my one big pick yesterday. They rolled over. San Francisco, twenty-seven to nine, and tonight I have a hundred dollars on the Houston Texans, who I think will win eight in a row. So in hindsight. The DePaulo family went four for four on fucking picks. Buy your picks today. Hit me up. Um, that'll do it. I ended up up 3,900. My dad won 185. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Please share. Please like. Please, please like. I work on these hard. And it really helps when you guys like. It really helps to bother to click. Thank you.